I are very busy nowadays. We went shopping today for the wedding. Uh, that's right, we went shopping in Eminonu. <laughs> it was very crowded. We lost track of time. We were buying many things. And thank goodness that we could get here on time. Did you buy everything that you need? There are some little things that we still need, but we're gonna get there. So you're completing the errands? We are. Karem is tired. He's very quiet today. Yeah, I've never been this tired, not even when I was working back at home. Oh, don't exaggerate. <laughs> he walked a lot today. He gets tired. I'm not complaining, though, you know? You look well today. I do support your decision to start all over again together as well. Your family support you too, don't they? They do. Actually, your photographs on the marriage certificate will be changed, and symbolically, this is a very important progress. You've done it so well, too. But I wonder what you are feeling. What do you feel inside when you're doing all of those things together? Today, what I want to talk about is everything that you feel and are thinking. You go first. No, you go first. Actually, everything is in order. I couldn't imagine that I'd be this happy. But I'm a bit afraid. I think Karem feels the same. Why is that? I mean, I'm not afraid of getting married. And we do deserve it. But I'm afraid of losing all the happiness that we have now. I'm kind of afraid of losing my happiness. And I'm just getting used to the feeling of happiness. Why do you think that you'll lose the happiness that you have? I don't know. Do you think the same way, Karam? I do. I feel the same way, yeah. What might be the reason that makes you feel these particular feelings of insecurity? How can I explain it? I'm good. I feel very happy a lot of the time, and for the first time in my life. But also I say, Fatma Ghul, don't get your hopes up. I want to let it go, but I also say, be careful now. Just take it easy. There's no reason, actually, as you've already said. Everything is very good. Our family supports us. There's no problem between me and Karem. We'll start to live on our own, and in our own house. But also, I just feel like this sometimes. Feeling like that is very normal, because you have lived through something traumatic like that before in your life, haven't you? You know what loss is. You were happy, and then suddenly you were ruined for a period of time. You deliberate now because of the difficult days that you've lived. And you try to be much more careful subconsciously. You simply don't want to let it go that easily. It's something very normal. But I don't want to feel like that. I'm disturbed by this fear. I just don't want anything that belongs to our ugly past to be part of this new beginning. I think you'll succeed with that. There will be a new beginning for you if you keep working. Fatma Ghul can talk about her feelings, thankfully. She's not afraid anymore. This was a big step. Fatma Ghul, it's a very important process. I'm so proud of you. There won't be any more of this fear within time. It will end up disappearing, and I know you can both do this. You'll be married soon. Are you nervous about the requirements of marriage? Let's talk about your wedding night, if you don't mind. Uh, if you want to talk to her alone, I can leave. No, don't. Please stay. That night, we'll be by ourselves.
I remember what you've said. You said that it will be different this time with Karem. The other one was a savage experience. I said to you that my brain is trying to forget, but my body cannot. Not anymore. Karem, when you touch me, when you caress and hold my hand, when you kiss me, I don't feel the same. I feel happy. Hearing you speak like this is good. Fatma Gul surprises me every single day. She has so much courage. Don't you feel that you are courageous? I've never seen someone who's that strong before. Fatma Gul's stronger than I am. She keeps on fighting no matter how much she's hurting inside. I'm afraid of hurting you, Fatma Gul. That's why I'm afraid of that night. I'm afraid of how we started. But I'm... I'm not afraid anymore. We've overcome all of the hardships and difficulties. And we're happily in love. We want to be a family now. We, we want to have children so, so I can overcome all this. These, these adversities together, you know? I'm the happiest man in the world now. <laughs>